What's wrong, buddy? No. <laughs> no, man. Come on, man. Just tell me what it is. Let's say <laughs> no, it's wrong. I don't want to. I can't even. I, this is even <laughs> acting at this point. I just can't. I don't, don't want to do this, man. Oh, you know, I'm, I'm okay with ridiculous stuff. I am. I love making stupid and over-the-top shit for D&D. &D. Yeah. This is fun. But there's a line. There, There is very much a line where it's like, mm -mm, I don't want to do that. Like, <laughs> no. Okay. I, I sort of knew how you were feeling, and I've got a little, little twist, a little twist on it that I think would make it a little bit more enjoyable. What? Why don't we make this monster... This disgusting, gross monster. And then we make it baby. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. That's what we're doing. It. We're doing it. All right, everybody. Yes. A little, uh, I guess a little context here. As you all know, Dungeon Master Therapy, the ever so famous skit that I guess I became known for on TikTok and now on YouTube. Um, where I come up with just stupid stuff that a dungeon master or his players have made, and I kind of bring it to light to life, and sometimes I'll make a staff log about it, sometimes I won't, sometimes it's a joke. Well, recently we've been making stats for some of these things, and they're kind of ridiculous, they're kind of stupid, but they're fun. Recently, uh, somebody made, I think they made Beholdemot, because I mentioned in a video, uh, you know, oh, you take Tiamat and a Beholder, and you put them together, and you get Beholdemot. And somebody made a Beholdemot stat block. And I reviewed that, and it was ridiculous. And then, <laughs> I made Lichzilla. Which was Godzilla and a Lich mixed together. And the wonderful people in our Discord server have highly requested Beholdemot Lichzilla. And I have refused... <laughs> For I months. It. I hate it! Like, Let's make it. But baby. But baby. But baby. Alright, well, we let's get, get into baby. it. baby. I guess the first thing we need to start with is the name, right? What's which, What are we naming this thing? Are we naming it just Behold a Mot Litzilla? But baby? <laughs> <laughs> no, I think it should be baby and then whatever its name is. No, I think it should be Behold a Mot Litzilla and the tag is baby. Okay. Yeah, I can I, I can deal with that. Dude, just type. looking at this name is fing stupid. Yeah, alright, so the name is Behold a Mot Litzilla. Lot sorry, size is large. Type uh -huh. is uh nope. Uh tag is baby. Alignment is just straight chaos. That's it. Yeah. It just, I, I, no. I think that makes sense. Because it, it is sense. a baby. It would be pretty chaotic. It would. It very much would. Alright, let's start with the AC. AC and hit well, die. Well, first, here? I need I need to visualize this. Mm -hmm. Body of wanna... Godzilla. Heads yes. like T Tiamat. Well, now, okay, so let's let's put it into context real quick. So T uh, uh, Beholdemot was okay. Tiamat, the five headed uh -huh. dragon, but the heads were instead Beholder heads. Be beholder heads. Yes. Right? Yes. I so don't... essentially, it's like. I don't Tiamat, like it. Yeah, neither do I. Tiamat and Godzilla's oh. body mixed together with beholder heads, but undead because it... Lich? It doesn't make any fucking sense. This is the line I was talking about. Like, this is why. This is why I said no. I'm like, I'm like, no. There's there's a line you don't fucking cross that I refuse to do, and that's why I haven't done it. And I'm just okay. like, man, no. Ugh. All right, because it's large, the hit die are D10, so 3D10. That's fine. Uh, yeah. six, so as an AC of eight with 16 HP. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yep, worse for me. All right, this thing is a baby. Okay. What should its walking speed be? <laughs> 15 uh, crawling. Was, <laughs> 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 can't burrow, <laughs> f you. Climb speed, can't fly, it's a baby. Fly speed, 10. Yeah. It's a baby. <laughs> it's, it's barely learning how to fly. Just gonna you said can't fly? Oh yeah, he no. can fly. He can fly 10 feet. Yeah, he can barely fly 10 feet. It's Swim like speed. a glorified chicken. Swim speed, I think you should have like a swim speed of like probably ten because it is Why? Part, it's part Godzilla. Because and baby. It's part Godzilla and baby. And babies know how to swim. It's they do. true. Yeah. Naturally. They just do. Yeah. Um okay. Strength. Six. No, it's still It's still a large it's still creature. A large I'd say creature. like twelve. 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 12. 12 makes sense. Is this thing dexterous? 
No, it's a baby, dude. It's, it's clumsy. <laughs> it's clumsy. What a six for Dex. A six. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Constitution. Yeah, yeah. I think it should have some decent constitution. It does have eighteen. Like, yeah, it does have the mix of like all these stupid things. Intelligence. It does. It is part lich. So I mean, like, it's probably 16. a smart baby. Yeah, 16, 16, like. 16. Wisdom, eight. Eight, it's fucking baby. Charisma, but charisma four. 20. 20? 20. I love babies, man. I love babies. I say, Everybody loves babies. Look at this thing and you're horrified. Ian's gonna be pissed. <laughs> I don't, <laughs> I'm trying to draw this thing. I do not care. <laughs> All right, saving throws. Proficient in none, because no. baby. Because baby. Skills, none, because baby. Oh, perf no, persuasion. Deception. Persuasion and deception. Expertise. Cause baby. Expertise, because Cause baby. baby. Dude, my, my son, he like, he knows what he's not allowed to have. Right now it's magic cards. Mm -hmm. If I blink, he's got them. And I'll just be like, hey, <laughs> can I have those? And he's just like, ah, ah. <laughs> he throwing he them around. everywhere. I hate it. Uh, okay, immunities, uh, it can't be charmed. I think charming this thing is impossible because it's too cute. It probably charms you. Yeah, I think we should give it a charm red for think. one of the baby heads. Yeah, I do like that, yeah. Uh, damage types uh, that is resistant or immune to or vulnerable to. I think it should have resistance to non-magical attacks. This thing has a bunch of features of all this stupid nonsense to it, so I think it should have resistance. Or to be funny, I, immunity, <laughs> because it's only got 16 HP. That's fine with me. Yeah. Well, its HP is going to go up when that con goes up, isn't it? It's got 28 HP. Yeah, it's a little bit more. But yeah, I think it should be immune. All right, languages. Speaks, understand, none. It can't speak. It's a baby. Give it its own language called Goo Goo Gaga. <laughs> Goo Goo Gaga. It speaks Goo Goo Gaga. Okay. Now, well, that way, if it has a language, say someone's got, like, one of those helmets that lets you speak any language. Yeah, or, like, comprehend language, yeah. That would just be really funny for the DM to have to be like, okay, you talk to... It's... It... It, it wants its mom! It, just, it wants its dad! <laughs> like, you have to, get, you have to DM that. Yeah. All right. Blind Sight. No. Dark Vision. 15 feet. Tremor Sense. No. True Sight. 60 feet. Oh. I've seen some perceptive babies, man. They just... It's a baby. You can't trick me. Hell that's yeah. Yeah, I like it. And it makes sense. All the heads, too. All right, that's the easy part. That, was, that yeah. was all the easy part. The hard part is the rest of the bullshit, like the attacks, ah. abilities. Uh, this is a legendary creature. I think we can agree on that. Yes. Okay. What? Let's start with, I guess, the legendary actions. What should the legendary actions be? I think legendary actions should be beholder rays. And I think that should be the only things that we give the, from the beholder. Boom. Okay. Legendary actions done. It's a fucking baby. Okay. This thing has five heads. It needs a breath weapon. It does need a breath weapon. But should, each head, have a, should each head have a different. It has also because dragon. No. I think the main head should have a breath weapon. I think the other heads should be just for the rays. Alright, the only legendary actions then are the Beholder eye stock abilities. Right? Right. Okay. Yes. Cool. Now let's get into regular actions. Yes. Right? Okay, so this is going to be a breath weapon attack. Yes. Um... Lightning. <sighs> Lightning? And necrotic. At the same time. Yes. We'll just call it baby, be we'll just call it baby breath. Yes, yeah. it should do lightning and necrotic damage. You know, like how, uh, like, uh, what is it, radiant fire? Whichever one that comes down and it does like 46 radiant, 46 fire. Like, I like how they have splits like that sometimes yeah. that, that do too. And since it's undead, I just think it would be cool. Behold of Might Litzilla breathes out forks of lightning infused with necrotic energy. Target must make cream a cheese with DC, chive and onion. It's a baby, so DC 13. That sounds fair. Dexterity saving throw. Sure. Or take. I, I think if you fail None. the saving throw, you take a stupid amount of damage. Like, I think it should be eight lightning. I think it should be and hit or 66 miss. 66 necrotic. Yeah. 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 Failure saving throw, you get hit. Pass your saving throw for zero. And I pass the target. Takes no damage. Takes zero damage. Because it's a baby. 
He's still a lot of Target take a DC 13 baby. dexterity saving throw. Take 8 D8 lightning and 66 necrotic damage on a pass. A target on a pass target takes zero damage. That is an <laughs> action, correct? That action. Yes, 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 okay. yes. Okay. Yes. Uh, we also need to give it some sort of spells. Spell casting. Man, this how? Uh, okay, let's redact for a second. How many? As a bit innate spell casting, it just knows. It just it just knows. Yeah. It just knows. It's in, it's, so this is a very magical creature. Innate spell casting. I'm assuming a spell casting ability modifiers me charisma. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I think it should only have one wizard spell prepared. That's counter spell. <laughs> <laughs> I think you should have like four slots for counter spell, and that's it. King, no, I'll just put King Cast Counterspell at will. Yes, that's perfect. That's counterspell it. at will. Um, okay, not even an eight cast. Okay, so it's not an eight spell casting. It's just. Uh-huh. <laughs> nope. And power word kill. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Uh, so Tiamat, we're giving it the multiple heads. Yeah. Uh, and I think we should give it a few condi uh, condition immunities. Huh? Uh, blinded, charmed, deafened. Yeah, we already gave it charmed. Yeah, but also blinded and deafened because of the multiple heads. That makes sense. Seems to make sense to me. Yeah. And then maybe stunned. I do like stunned. Yeah. You know what? We're just going to make immune to everything. Okay. No. That seems a little ridiculous, though. Yeah, it is ridiculous. Because it's, a, it's, <laughs> a, baby. it's a baby. It's a baby. It's a baby. All right, we got the abilities. Ha ha, no. <laughs> Hold on, my list of luck and cast counterspell at will in a limited amount of times per day. Actions, baby breath. It breathes out that ridiculous breath. Legendary actions, it has beholder rays. It costs one as a rays, which a beholder would have. It can shoot one at random as a legendary action. We need this thing a bite? Yes. Like, you just call it, like, gooey bite? Uh, melee weapon attack. I guess it'll be strength based. Yes. No, 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 no. Make it charisma based and make it only do psychic damage. Because uh, <laughs> like just that. imagine this little thing just gumming on your arm. <laughs> it doesn't even have teeth yet. Like it might have one tooth, but you know this damage is more psychologically traumatizing than anything. Yeah. Baby bite. And then how many hit points does it have? 28. Can we give this creature regeneration? Oh, easy, yeah. And I want it to regain 28 hit points at the start of its turn if it has at least <laughs> one hit point. <laughs> I think it's going to do 2d10 psychic damage. That sounds good. Another bite. All right, and that's an action. I think that's the only physical attack it should have, though. Oh, yeah, that's it. Absolutely, yeah. The key, yeah it's should it be able to do it five times, though? Because it's got five heads. They, no, the other ones are more like beholder stocks. They they they're they're shooting eye rays and I gotcha. stuff. Okay. I don't think they should get any bites. I mean, I wouldn't mind if we gave it a tail attack. Just up the ante a little bit. It should have a tail attack. It should. Well, let's give it. You said immunity to what again? Uh, charmed, deafened, no, and blinded. No, it was something else. So you would say. Oh, uh, no, regeneration. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to give it regeneration and just have it regain 28 hit points at the start of its turn if it has at least one hit point. So if you don't kill it on its turn, it's back on full then every turn. Yep. I like that. Cool. All right, let's go over what we have so far because I hate it. Oh, let's do a tail attack. Yeah. A D12 because it's my favorite dice. I was going to Yep, that works. One D12. A D12. It's just my favorite die. Yep. I don't see it used often enough. His, his strength is six, so he'll still get like what minus two <laughs> to damage. Yeah, that's fucking hilarious. Yeah, maybe. Should we give it the same multi attack? Nah. Nah. nah it doesn't. Nah, need that's it. already stupid enough. It doesn't need it. All right. I think we should give it one other power. That's what I'm thinking too. I'm just trying to like brain. I want to give it something stupid that just it just has no reason having. Like um, a lich's phylactery. It does need some lich stuff. Well, counter spell, like like something stupid for no like freedom of movement or just something stupid. What about? Can we give it the opposite of a frightful presence? Just like a charmful aura. Yeah, it just I think it should be tossed out of like. Don't you want to go? Aw. 
I do like that. You just change it a little stinker. <laughs> a little stinker. I like it. A little stinker. All right. The ability. A little stinker. Any creature that becomes yeah, any creature that comes within 30 feet of the Beholder Mott Lichzilla must make a DC 20 charisma saving throw. They also become enthralled and under control of the Beholder Mott Lichzilla for 1d6 days. They feel an urge to protect Beholder Mott Lichzilla for the duration. They can make the saving throw after the days rolled are over. If they fail the saving throw again, they take an oath to protect Beholder Mott Lichzilla and raise it to adulthood to wreak havoc amongst the realms. I love it. There you go. I love it. Last but not least, challenge rating. I don't know. Challenge rating is for so me is always weird. so garbage, bro. The it's challenge rate. I primarily way. go. I the, okay. The only reason I like really base anything for challenge rating, I guess, is because it determines like the proficiency bonus. So I guess what would you want the proficiency bonus of this thing to be? Like a plus two. Yeah. To like a CR three then. Yeah. Or maybe a plus three. So like a CR five. Maybe a CR five. Okay. CR five. All right. Because even though it's a baby, it is the baby of some pretty big dog things. I hate it. I hate it. All right. Well, let's review then. Behold a Motlitzilla. Large nope baby chaos alignment. AC six. Hit points twenty eight. Speed fifteen foot walking. Ten foot fly. 10 foot swimming, strength 12, dex 6, con 18, int 16, wisdom 8, charisma 20. Skills, deception is plus 11, persuasion is plus 11. <laughs> Damage yes. immunities, bludgeoning, piercing, and slash from non-magical text. Condition immunities, blinded, charm, deaf, and stunned. Senses, dark vision 15 feet, true sight 60 feet, passive perception is a 9, because it's a baby. Languages, goo goo gaga, CR5. Its abilities are Haha ha, Nope. The Beholder Mott Lichzilla can cast Counterspell at will and limited amount of times per day. <laughs> it has regeneration. The Beholder Mott Lichzilla regains 28 hit points at the start of its turn if it has at least one hit point. Invincible baby. Yes. Lil Sinker. Any creature that comes within 30 feet of the Beholder Mott Lichzilla must make a DC 20 charisma saving throw or else they become enthralled under control of the baby of the Beholder Mott Lichzilla for 1d6 days. They feel an urge to protect Beholder Mott Lichzilla for the duration. They can make the saving throw again after the rolled days are over. If they fail the saving throw, they take an oath to protect Beholder Mott Lichzilla and raise it to adulthood to wreak havoc amongst realms. The actions. Baby breath. Beholder Mott Lichzilla breathes out and... F yeah. Actions. Baby Breath. Behold a Mott Lichzilla breathes out forks of lightning infused with necrotic energy up to 30 feet in a line. Target must make a DC 13 deck saving throw or take 8d8 lightning and 66 necrotic damage. On a pass, the target takes 0 damage. Baby Bite. Plus 8 to hit. 10 foot reach. 1 target. 2d10 plus 5 psychic damage. Tail Attack. It's a plus 4 to hit. 15 foot reach. It's 1d12 plus 1 bludgeoning damage. And the legendary actions are essentially it has the legendary actions of a Beholder. Or it can shoot random stocks of eye beams. I fucking hate this thing. Like a lot. I'm upset we had to do it. I'm not upset that we had to do it because it's a cute little baby now. Now, this is, the, here's the problem with us making it a baby is because, and let me tell you what the problem is. Because we gave it the ability a little stinker, that uh -huh. means that somebody's gonna use this thing. Okay. Yep. Yep, yep. And then an entire party at some point is going to fail that saving throw twice. Yep. And they will have to raise this into adulthood. And the campaign yep. is going to be, become about raising Beholdemont Lichzilla into As adulthood. It and then they're going to do though. what? They're going to do what? Hey, Brandon Steak, what are the stats for adult be Beholdemont Lichzilla? And that, <laughs> in which case, I we'll will. do it. No. <laughs> Big stinker. We have to upgrade. Upgrades, people. It's a big Upgrades. stinker. Oh big my gosh. stinker. I refuse to release this out into the world for free. However, we did, you know, we told you all the stats for it. So if you want all the stats, but if you want it in a nice, convenient little little stat block, then feel free to join the Patreon where you can just look at it, download it, and. God, if you, guys, people, folks, everybody on the internet, if you use this thing, please in the comments tell me how it goes what happens and just what your party even thinks i i'm so done i, I want to see a do. lot of campaigns be taken over by this horrible i can't do this anymore creature this is why dungeon master therapy has become the bane of my existence 
because this is what happens. <laughs> oh my god. But you were telling me just like a month ago, you know what I really want to make? A beholder Matt Lich Godzilla creature. And I was like, you sure, man? And you were like, hell yeah. No, the that roof. is not how that conversation off. went. The conversation went, hey man, I made this and I made this. Now people want me to take the two and just put them together. And I was like, that's the line. You have this thing, you have Behold Mott, you have Litzilla, and there's a line right here. You don't cross that line. And instead, what do they do? They took the two things, and they broke the f line, and just smushed them together, and what do you get is this. You get this. Me and you making a baby together. I don't like the way you said that at all. I mean, you said this is what you get, and I was like, me and you together. So this is right how the, this is how the community gets us to make a baby together. Okay, all right, everybody, I'm done. I'm gonna have a, huh. a mig. I have a I, I have a migraine. I have I'm gonna a, go have a, a go have a smoke. That was fun making that baby with you. <laughs> 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 all right, everybody, make sure you like and subscribe. We'll see you next time on the Cancer Cast, and we'll see you at Gen Con in like a week or whatever. So goodbye, everybody. Bye.